Explain how the training principle of type may vary when applied to several sports. Compare three different sporting examples in your answer. So let's take a look at the answer. Sports performers should always include a variety of training methods in their programs. The best coaches vary training to help with motivation and boredom, as well as targeting different components or weaknesses. A games player such as a footballer, hockey player or netballer could include aerobic endurance training such as continuous or interval sessions. They could also include circuit or free weight sessions to target strength improvements. Speed and plyometric sessions could be also incorporated to help with speed and agility in a match setting. A swimmer could focus on the main compound free weight exercises such as bench press, squat and deadlift or any other Olympic lifts to help with overall strength and power for the shorter swimming events. They could also train flexibility to help lengthen their swimming strokes and make their technique more efficient. A cricket or rounders player could increase upper body strength by completing circuit training or free weight sessions as well as flexibility training to reduce the risk of injury. A basketball player could aim to improve their vertical jump by increasing power through free weight exercises or plyometrics. Golfers require a basic level of aerobic endurance to walk around the course for a full round of golf, so should include aerobic endurance training such as continuous or interval training. They could also include flexibility training such as static or ballistic stretches to avoid repetitive strain injuries. So a level one mark answer provides basic understanding of the principle of type it provides simple examples that to how type could be used in training and only one sport is covered. A level 2 mark answer provides good understanding, it provides several simple examples and more than one sport is covered but in basic detail. And then a level 3 mark answer provides clear understanding, provides several examples and provides detailed examples of different training methods for all three sports. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, follow on social media, and make sure you check out my fit and fitness component t-shirt. All the links are in the description below.